Hi everyone. Welcome back to the Lambda Test YouTube channel. In this video we will see how to perform K6 browser testing on the Lambda Test platform. But first let's talk a bit about what is K6. Grafana K6 is an open source tool that makes load testing easy for developers and QA engineers. Besides enabling teams to identify performance bottlenecks, K6 allows developers to build scalable high performing websites and mobile applications. Some of the most common uses of K6 are load testing, browser testing, kiosk and resilience testing, performance and synthetic monitoring. The browser model by K6 is an extension that allows you to perform browser automation and end-to-end -end web testing through Chrome DevTools protocol. The K6 browser module contains a set of browser-level APIs to interact with browsers and collect metrics about front-end performance. Now that we have touched upon the K6 and its core features, let's go ahead to perform web automation using K6 on Lambda Test. To get started, install K6 on your local machine. You can find the link to the installation guide from the official documentation. To execute test on Lambda Test, you will need to set your Lambda Test username and access key in the environment variables. To get your credentials, head to your Lambda Test profile and then go to Password and Security tab. Once you have configured your Lambda Test credentials, clone the Lambda Test K6 GitHub repository. You can find the link to the GitHub repo from the official documentation. Navigate to the clone directory where your sample code base is located. As you can see, here is our automation script k6sample.js. This script runs on Chrome browser on Mac OS Ventura. It visits the DuckDuckGo search engine and then searches for the term Playwright. The test script will grab the Lambda test username and access key from the environment variables. You can also notice the defined automation capabilities like browser name, browser version, platform, and so on. To compile and run the script on Lambda test, we will pass the k6 browser enabled command. Once we execute this command, navigate back to the Lambda test automation dashboard. As you can see, the test ran on its target browser and operating system. When you click on the respective test, you can view its session details. As you can notice, the automation dashboard shows the test execution details like test name, test ID, and different debugging options like video logs, command logs, network and console logs. You can also find the basic test information, download link to test session recordings, and so on. In case you wish to perform K6 browser testing on Lambda Test yourself, you can check our official documentation. We hope you like this video. To get more such videos, subscribe to Lambda Test YouTube channel for the latest tutorials around automation testing, mobile app testing, and much more.